Hey, Stephen Young here for Acid or Auctioneers. Great Texas Mopar Hoard Auction Event with item number 87, a 1967 Dodge Coronet 440 four-door sedan. Uh, we can see it looks to be very, very straight and clean. The fender emblem says V8. So we look under the hood to find... Okay, this is the 383 with a two-barrel. This is the G-code with uh, about 290 horsepower, I guess. This one is equipped with manual drum brakes all the way around, power steering, the aluminum flex fan right there, and the 26-inch wide Hemi spec radiator. Very nice to see. The trim tag is present and accounted for, WH41. Nice to see that. The grill on this one is in pretty good shape. Not too bad, a little bit of dingles here. The bumper's kind of munched, but again, I don't see much in the way of rust at all. Let's break out the magnet. Uh, I dare say this might be an original paint car. I don't see any signs of rust repair down here. Yeah, this is absolutely solid metal right here. Let's look at the bottom of the door. And again, no bubbling, nothing. The rocker panel also looks very, very nice. Let's take a peek inside. And, okay, there is the bench seat interior. You would expect to see in a four-door Coronet 440 series. A little dusty, but again, I'll take dust any day over rust. The instrument cluster is present and accounted for. An aftermarket uh, sort of AM, FM, CD player kind of deal going on. Uh, factory air-conditioned dashboard with the vents underneath the radio area. Backs, back door opens to reveal, yeah, you know, another tattered seat, but again, it is all there. Easily reupholstered. Quarter panels on this one are equally as nice as up front. I don't see any signs of rust. This is wonderful. No rust at all. And again, Coronet 440 would be here. That's okay. The rear bumper looks very nice. Texas plate. Uh, yeah, single exhaust on the two-barrel car. Inside the trunk, we see the original blue paint. I think it's B5. Uh, here's the fan shroud in two pieces, but it is there underneath this piece of wood. We find, look at that. The spare tire well is not perforated. It looks to be very, very much rust-free. Let's continue our trip around the passenger side where we see, yeah, equally beautiful quarter panel. My gosh, no rust anywhere. And Cornet 440, again, that's the series, not the engine. Lower quarters, okay, a little bit of bubbling here. It's not bad. That's nothing. Okay, down low here, nothing. And the door, okay, doesn't want to open here. There we go. Another peek inside. And I love that Texas Prairie, Texas Prairie dust everywhere. <laughs> but again, you can clean that stuff out. Nice, solid car. Can't see the floors, but my guess is that the floors will be as nice as the body. And again, down here on the bottom fender, nice, rust-free car. So the beauty of this car is that it's a four-door 383. Pretty uncommon. Most of these things are 318 powered or slant six powered. So that's the story of lot 87, a 1967 Dodge Coronet 440 series four-door sedan. Bid accordingly. <laughs>